Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We are now going to be playing in the Joseph Martinez Become a Legend series again. If you guys do prefer me to just focus on one or the other, maybe whenever FIFA 20 comes out, I only focus on one or the other more so than the other, I should say. Um, let me know in the comment section down below, Joseph Martinez in Argentina or uh, Miguel Almiron with uh, Newcastle. Obviously, both career modes could end up going to whatever team may end up wanting us or we want to go to, um, but these are just starting places where uh, we're at. So so if you guys do want to see more of either one of these series, let me know in the comment section down below and I will do my best to get that content out for you guys. But today we're going to be playing in the Copa Total Argentina or whatever the pronunciation is, but we're going to be playing in this uh, competition um, against old boys, which is, you know, obviously super historic club. We're just going to hop into the game, see what we can do, see if we can keep moving forward, see if we can grab our first goal because we did not score in the first episode of this series. So we'll go ahead and hop into the game and see what we can do. They've been passing the ball in the same spot for so long. I'm just kind of waiting for them to take a shot at this point. I'm not going to come in too far deep because I don't, I still want to be able to counter. But that's the opportunity they come up with and they've been passing the ball for almost 10 minutes. 10, 10 game minutes, I should say. Somehow a foul came out of that too, I'm not too sure. But a goal came out of it as well, so we're 1-0 down. I don't really know what's going on in this game anymore. Um, I'm a bit confused. Don't really know where the foul was. I, I guess I missed it. I don't know. If you guys saw the foul, let me know in the comment section down below. But we're 1-0 down against old boys. So now we have to play catch up. I think we've touched the ball once this game, maybe twice. And uh, that's about it. So let's see if we can bring it back uh, while we're in this cup game. But what a beautiful free kick. Keeper didn't really dive to the best of his ability. But that is okay. We move forward. Just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Going for it. He's go. Let's go! I did not think we were going to score that. I wasn't even commentating or anything. That was an absolute banger of a goal. We managed to beat him on the back line again this time. Ran straight at the keeper and put it top corner. 1 1. We get our first goal. I was going to say debut goal, but it's not our first game ever. Um, but. 1-1. One, one. Let's go, baby. Look at this run. Beautiful little touch. Defender's way too slow. We're able to bang it. Keeper can't quite get a hand to it. And it goes top corner. Let's go. Beautiful little pass from the left mid there. End of regulation, possibly? It's 1-1 one, one at the end of 90 minutes. I'm not too sure if that's the end of the game. And we're playing another leg, or if we're going to PKs, because it's really early in the competition. Um, I would imagine, I was going to say, I think it's two legs. So, we got a decent amount of possession. We tried another shot opportunity. Um, we did get man of the match, which is amazing. Um, but it is only 1-1, one, one, and we take it into the second leg, I think. Um, and then we'll see where we go from there. So, okay, yeah. So, yeah. Because they're showing... First round scores, so there is going to be a second leg. Beautiful. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are hopping into the second game of this episode, and it's actually going to be up against Boca Juniors. Um, obviously, very, very important game for us here. Tito is also in the squad, so if you guys did miss the first episode, we did bring back Hector Tito Vialba uh, to San Lorenzo with Joseph Martinez to kind of give us at least a little bit of a partnership. We understand at least a little bit, even though Tito doesn't look like himself in this game. Um, we are going to be playing, I think, let's see, do we want to play in our away kits maybe? And we'll let Boca play in their home kits. So let's go ahead and hop into the game and see we are again starting. So hopefully we can grab our second goal for the club, first goal in the Argentinian Super League. I think we should get one more opportunity before the end of the half. We're just trying to win the ball back here. Boca doing really, really well to hold up the ball. They're going to get a decent opportunity. The ball does go out for a corner, so we might not actually get another chance before the end of the half. I'm going to try to play for the counter just in case. Yeah. That's going to be the end of the first half. 
So we've had a couple opportunities. I don't... We haven't had a shot yet. But we've gotten into some really, really good spaces. Um, and this Boca team does mess around with the ball quite a bit in the midfield. And it has let us have some opportunities um, to actually score. So uh, I think in this second half... Actually, not the end of the half. I think in the second half, though, we'll have a definitely at least a couple more opportunities um, to get the win against Boca here away from home. If, if this half ever ends. This ref is giving him every opportunity in the world. Thank you. And of course, now it's over. So now again, end of the first half. Hopefully again, second half, we can get some more opportunities and try to throw up a couple goals against Boca. Um, and put them into a tough position. We've had 38% possession, which really doesn't tell a full story. The last 10 minutes all went to Boca, um, so it did sway the numbers heavily because uh, for decent parts of the first half, we did actually have the ball quite a bit. So. I believe we did also just come off. We did. <laughs> We've been trying so hard to score. We've been keeping the ball so well against Boca. They end up, we concede a foul. I get taken off. And Boca grabs a free kick right off the rip. Beautiful goal. There's so many free kicks that get scored by the CPU in this game, man. Navarro, there was no way he was ever going to save that. Decent, decent goal. And we're 1-0 down against Boca. Again, we're just going to simulate the rest of the game here. See if we can grab a goal. See if the other striker can do anything that we could not. And hopefully grab a goal and equalizer to come away with at least a point from Boca. De Rossi concedes a foul. De Rossi looks great in this game, as you would expect. We had 20 touches before we were taken off the field. San Lorenzo are looking desperate here, short on time and options. Well, it's looking like too little too late, but they are giving it all they have. Lobs it in gently. Almost, almost a great opportunity. San Lorenzo have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. So this is going to be the end of the game here. We are going to lose against Boca. Unfortunately, we did play well for large parts of that game, but we couldn't end up keeping up with them in the end. We give up a pretty stupid foul and end up losing the game on a free kick, which I feel like has happened quite a few times already in Pez to me. But nonetheless, we do end up losing 6.0 rating for us, 6.0 rating for Tito. And that is going to be the end of this episode. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you leave a comment, leave a like. Let me know what do you guys think about the series. Do you guys want to see more of this on the channel? And other than that, I will see you guys next time. Peace.